Given that this is a special year, we thought it was a good time to formally recognize three people who, year in and year out, are instrumental in running this fair. Not to mention, they're a real pleasure to work with. I ask that all the directors please stand and remain standing as we celebrate and honor Dan West, Cindy Patterson, and Wileen Rickley. But Wileen, um, did you know you were going to get an award today? I did not. This was top secret. Oh, I forgot my pen too. Wow. And um, <laughs> so, what's the award for? For service to the fair? For service and volunteering, and uh, but I've been around a long time. 1978 to 2015. Wow. Now um, you, you're sharing this award uh, with Cindy Patterson, who's our office manager. Right over there. She's over there, and Dan West, who is our manager. Tell us again the story of how you got to be called Pig. <laughs> My father wanted a boy, and when they told him he had a little girl, he called me a dirty little pig and stuff. And so I've been Pig ever since. Uh, uh, do people just call you Pig? Yeah. All of my family and my friends call me Pig. Do you have a little, and you do, you have a little pig. Yep, I, and I have my sty over here. Sure, sure. So, Nicholas, uh, how are you related to Miss Piggy? I am related to uh, my granny pig. I am her grandson. Oh, okay. What do you think about your grandma winning a special award? I think that's very fitting that uh, she would receive an award. I'm not sure exactly what it's for, but uh, she is one of the kindest and one of the most giving people I've ever known. <laughs> so you're buried under a mound of paper. I am. <laughs> uh, so how do you feel about getting this special award today? It was very surprising and it was very sweet. Do they ever let you out of this little room? I do get out occasionally. <laughs> but not during fair. Well, very seldom. <laughs> Congratulations. Well, thank you.